Konnichiwa, my name's Andy. Welcome to Uzumaki Garage. This episode is about the Evo 6 Idle Air Control, or the IAC. It's sometimes called the Fast Idle Air Control, IACV, or IACV motor, but to keep it simple, I'll just refer to it as the IAC. I've noticed the idle has been a bit rough when I stop at intersections, and sometimes I can hear fast clicking when I turn the ignition on before cranking the engine. With the ignition on, I'm feeling around and I find the clicking sound is coming from the IAC. The IAC is attached with four screws underneath the throttle body, so firstly I've removed some intercooler pipes and hoses so I can get better access to it. I'm disconnecting the harness from the IAC. Now I'm removing the wire clip from the throttle position sensor so I can remove it from the throttle body. I removed the three screws from the end of the IAC and removed the black plastic part to get better access to the throttle body coolant hose clamps. And to minimise the mess, I blocked off the coolant hoses with tapered yellow plugs, but I will have to bleed the cooling system again. But now I realise it's very difficult to get a screwdriver onto the screw heads, so I removed the strut brace to make some extra room. The IAC screws are putting up a fight, so I'll remove the throttle body next so I can work on it on the bench. Two of the screws came out easily, but the other two won't budge, so I'll give them a soak in penetrating oil. I'm using Corrosion X. I left them soaking for a couple of days, then I used a heat gun to gently warm up the housing, and I tried out my new Japanese impact screwdriver. It didn't loosen them, but it might have worked if I could hold the throttle body more securely. My next attempt will be using my old school impact driver, which is one of the very first tools I ever bought when I was only 13. I'm using carb cleaner to clean the throttle body. And I use compressed air to blow it out too. Then I installed a new IAC using new screws and a new O-ring. and I cleaned up the inlet manifold with a cloth sprayed with carby cleaner. I pushed the coolant hoses back onto the throttle body and set the clamps back in the original positions. Then I put a new gasket onto the throttle body and slid all four bolts through it to keep it in position. Then while keeping the gasket against the throttle body, I moved it closer to the inlet manifold and started all four bolts into the manifold while keeping the gasket against the throttle body's face. Otherwise it's difficult to get all of the bolts started. I pushed the throttle position connector back on and secured it with the wire clip.
I push the IAC connector onto the new IAC. And reattach the throttle cable. And replaced all the hoses, pipes and clamps that I removed or loosened at the beginning. So that turned out really well. There's no clicking when I turn the ignition on and it seems like it's idling better too. I've been meaning to do this job for quite a while, so it's great to finally get it done. But that's all for now. Like, subscribe, notify, PayPal me, and I'll see you next time. Thanks for watching.